I am Anil Kumar and in this video we will solve a word problem and apply the strategies learned for solving equations with fractional coefficients. It takes Sam 4 hours to paint a room. It takes Peter 6 hours to do the same. How long would it take them if they work together? So what we are given here is that one particular job, let us say the job is painting one room, the speed with which or the rate at which Sam can paint is one-fourth in an hour, right? So four hours to paint the whole room, so it takes one-fourth per hour, right? So the rate, we say rate for Sam is one over four per hour, right? Rate for Peter is 1 over 6 per hour. That is given to us. Now together, let us say together, they take x hours, right? Let's say they take x hours. In that case, one full job is done. How much will Peter do and how much will Sam do? That is what we need to figure out. So in x hours, the job done by Sam will be x over 4. For Peter, it will be x times 1 over 6, which is x over 6. And the job done is one full unit. The whole job. Do you get the idea? So that is how we can form relations or equations when we have job work to be done where rate is important, right? So that is kind of very important equation. I'd like you to go through this equation and understand how we got this one. Now, we'll apply the strategies learned for solving such equation, which has fractions as coefficients. So our strategy is multiply both sides by lowest common denominator. So we have to find the lowest common denominator. Between 4 and 6, the lowest common denominator is 12. So to solve, we have to multiply each term by 12. So we have x over 4 plus x over 6 equals to 1. So we'll multiply each term by 12, right? So to get rid of fractions, that's the whole idea, right? You could even write this in brackets. It means multiplication. 12 divided by 4 is 3, so we get 3x plus 12 divided by 6 is 2, 2x equals to 12. When you add them, you get 5x equals to 12, and you can divide by 5 to get the answer, right? So 12 divided by 5. So 5 times 2 is 10, we get 20.4. So the total job will take 2.4 hours. So that is in hours, right? So that is the answer. You could also write the answer in hours and minutes. So we are saying 2.4 hours. That means 2 hours and 4, how many, 0.4, I mean, I should write 0.4 times 60 minutes, right? 0.4 times 60 minutes, right? So 6 times 4 is 24. So it takes 2 hours and 24 minutes to complete the job if both of them work together, right? So that is how you could write your answer. I hope that helps. So let's go through it once again. Whenever you have job done or work done, find the rate of doing work. Formulate the equation by defining your variable. X is the unknown time. So, so it is x over 4 plus x over 6 equals to 1. Solve the equations with fractions by taking common denominator, multiply each term, and then solve for x. I hope that helps. Thank you.